All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video on the Just Kidding channel. So, as you read from the title, Paradox has shut down. Now, the reason Paradox has shut down, the devs made an entire announcement, and we'll be breaking it down in today's video. If you guys are new to the channel, please hit the video, subscribe, and turn on post notifications. I'm trying to hit 25k subs, so please let us go. Also, join up my Discord server in the description of this video. So, yeah, let's jump into it. So, so the owner of Paradox, Aiden, basically just said in the announcement that the release was just terrible. It had a little bit of content, it had a lot of bugs, it was just all around terrible. Now, I did make a video like two days ago, and in this video basically, I was just glazing the hell out of Paradox. Now, I was glazing it just to troll the Type Soul community, because the Type Soul community was having like a mini debate on which game will survive, will type soul survive or will paradox kill it and i was just adding to the fuel by just dropping a complete paradox glaze video and the comments on that video were pretty funny i hearted i hearted every single comment because it was just <laughs> hilarious to see people just talk about how much i was glazing and how they paid me and stuff but yeah um paradox did shut down and i did say in that video like if you guys like watched past the mega glaze that i did for like a minute you would know that I did go in depth and talk seriously about the game and said that the game was not ready for release. And I still stand by that, it was not ready for release. So when they released, I was I was just waiting for this to happen because I knew this was gonna happen because the game was not ready and it had like nothing to do. And for it to release on the same day as a big game like Type So and the fact that it doesn't even have a Bankai or Segunda in it that means it's just set up for failure from the start it had like no content to compete with type soul that has a huge amount of content in it and basically the grinding was just very unfun there was like nothing to do so aiden just made an announcement today and he just basically just talked about how he will plan to do many stuff when they reopen the game in a few weeks now the stuff that they plan to add is basically more content more stuff to do for example like bankai segunda and more stuff that they plan to add more bosses and more fun things to do in the game and basically that's pretty much all types that's basically what all paradox needed it just needed more content and more stuff to do because the game literally my friend <laughs> all right my friend literally maxed the game in three hours and my other friend did it in like a four hours there was nothing else to do and yes when i say max i didn't mean like 700 i mean like they maxed to the shikai visor and everything in the matter of hours that's literally it there was nothing else to do after that and no one was playing ranked because ranked is pretty much boring it's just skill spam so i do hope that when they do eventually re-release the game that they plan to add a lot more stuff to do while you're doing your grind to maximum potential but that's just my thoughts on the closure of the game i really do hope that when it reopens it does have a huge success and it lives up to the glaze that i was giving it <laughs> but yeah hope you guys enjoy can you sign off love y'all and peace